Hello everyone, in this video we would like to present you our new brand Digital Angle Finder Execute One. Let's take a close look at what it is and how different it is from Execute I. In this video we will be mostly comparing Execute I and Execute One. So if you haven't seen the video about our first Digital Angle Finder Execute I, we recommend you watch it first. It's linked in the upper right corner. Compared to Execute I, Execute One is a standalone digital angle finder, so it comes with just a cube itself, a charger, and a user manual. Execute One is a multitasking tool and has four modes of operation. When turning it on, it shows the mode of operation and its charge level. The first mode of operation is the inclinometer mode. In order to calibrate it, press the zeroing button for 15 seconds until the P1 indication appears. Then put it to the flat surface and press the same button again. When the P2 indication appears, turn Execute 1 180 degrees and press the zeroing button again. The inclinometer is well calibrated and now ready to measure the deviations. To change the mode of operation, press both buttons at the same time. For example, now it's P2 mode, which is designed for cadet and bleed sharpeners. To set the angle finder on cadet, select P2 mode and put it onto the abrasive holder and zero it. Then put it onto the angle finder platform and set the sharpening angle. And then fix it. If you need to keep an eye on the sharpening angle, put it back vertically onto the stone holder. And zero it on here. Take into account that Execute One maps values to within tenths of a degree. In order to switch to the third operation mode, which is designed for Q3 sharpeners, press both buttons at the same time. To zero it, put it onto the Enable Fire platform and press the right button. As you can see, there is a minus on a display, and it shows the reverse deviation. Now we've just zeroed it and it shows zero with a minus. Actually, there is nothing wrong with that, because Execute One is a high precise tool measuring to within a hundredth of a degree, and there might be a shift towards one of sides up to 0.05 degrees. After that, we are putting the angle finer on the stone holder, setting the sharpening angle and let's fix the lifting unit. Then let's switch to the angle finer operational mode. This is the fourth mode. As you can see, if we zero it in a horizontal position, the vertical lines appear, which means incorrect measurement. In this mode, zeroing takes place vertically. Also, take into account that the angle finer measures relatively one axis. For example, let's turn it 90 degrees and now we can see the differences on the display. Compared to Execute I, which works only with KO3 and which has only one operational mode, Execute One is a more universal and multitasking tool, which can be used with all sharpeners and even in an everyday life due to its built in inclinometer. New brand digital angle finder Execute One will be available for order at the end of March on our website and dealers. If you have any questions, leave them under this video and we will be happy to answer them. Thank you for watching, leave your likes below and subscribe to our channel. Take care and stay sharp.